Hey y'all, so this is my first video I'm making, starting, well, going on my fitness journey, and I'd love if y'all join me. So we're here at Planet Fitness. Just got this outfit from Ross. Got the socks there too. Bye. Bye. So yeah, super stoked. Spent like $17 on this outfit with this crop top, well, yeah, with the sports bra. Super cute. <laughs> Gotta wear these boots, so y'all will be good for that. That's right. We're not working on these today because we did boots yesterday, but today we're going to be doing shoulders and back. And of course, a little bit of biceps, triceps, a little bit of upper body stuff. So, start this off. We're going to put our pre workout in our nice little ghost battle from GNC. We're going to use the Lit Beyond Wear. This is the Blue Eyes Day Flavor. These are pretty good to use so if you feel like you need a little boost for at the gym. And of course, like, if you're going to drink coffee, these are also a good um, a good replacement for coffee. And this is how you can. Got your amino acids, which is good for your blood flow and everything like that. So it helps you get through your workout and makes you feel great and fully energized. So, we're almost out here, but we're going to do a little scoop. Just one scoop. I think it's recommended one scoop. Some of them recommend two scoops. It says recommend one scoop and eight for the last bottle. I think this is like a little more than eight. This is definitely 20, but we're still gonna do one scoop because we don't want to overdo it. Whoa. There we go. Okay, add some more water in there because I didn't drink any water. Look at that. Look at that. Woohoo! Greenish blue. Alright, now we're just gonna shake it up. And we're gonna go do our workout. Over here, I just filled up our water at the water fountain. We got a little filtered water. We'll take a sip of our blue raspberry lit pre workout. Delish. I highly recommend this pre workout. Of course, if you don't like blue raspberry, they have tons of flavors. You can get them online or you can get them in the store at GNC. So yeah, let's get to the workout like I said we were. All right, now I don't have one of the mini microphones to talk to y'all while I'm at the gym, so I'm just gonna be doing voiceovers for now. So we're just doing some basic stretching, get our bodies ready for our workout, get a little warmed up. You should always stretch before crazy activity so you don't injure yourself. And then we're gonna get right into our workout, starting with some bicep workout. We're gonna do some curls. We're gonna go in and to the side to work the different bicep muscles to get our blood flowing, get our bodies warmed up, because we're not targeting our biceps, but always like to start off with a little bicep workout. All right, we're gonna do some shows, get some shoulder action up in that thing, and then we're gonna head right to our tricep kickbacks. Same thing here. I think we did two sets of 10 reps for these though, with the 10 pound dumbbells, just to get a little tricep and bicep action, just to get ourselves ready for what we're actually working on, which is our back today. Get a little side view for y'all. Make sure your back is straight, shoulders are retracted back, and kick on back. Bam! Bam! Other side. Bam! 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 Alright, now we're going to get into our dumbbell shoulder press. We're using 15 pound dumbbells for this. We're going to go up and in. I like to do it like this because it's very nice and controlled and it really works them shoulder muscles. And then we're gonna bring it down nice and controlled. I wouldn't recommend doing that unless you really know you can control the weight coming down because you can injure yourself doing that if the weights are too heavy. I believe we did 10 reps of three sets for these. Five up, five in. Very good workout to do. I think we did this and one other workout for shoulders because had to do some shoulder action because I missed shoulders on chest day, but mostly targeting the back today, so yeah. And then we got one more set left. Thank you, Steph. 
Southern here in this last set. But got through it. Now we're just going to stand up and shake it on it. Shake, shake, shake. Shake, shake, shake. Shake. Okay, so here we're about to do our bent over dumbbell rows with our 15 pound dumbbells. Um, I ended up doing two sets of 10 reps on each side. This is focusing on our lats. So now we're getting into our back workouts. Show you all side view in a second. Make sure the back is nice and straight. Your shoulders are back and retract it and you're just pulling it on back. Pulling it up. Pulling it up. Pulling it up. How was that? We're gonna grab our five pound dumbbells and we're doing our back flies. Another back work workout for us, focusing on our lats. You wanna make sure your knees are slightly bent, you're bent a little bit at an angle, and you're just pulling on up. Working that back out. Yeah, I believe. I believe I did three sets of 10 reps for these just because it was a light five pound weight. Used a five pound weight also just because doing more back workouts and I didn't want to overdo it and like exhaust myself before it got to the real crazy part. All right, now we're gonna do our front raises and lateral raises, focusing on our shoulders once again, using the five pound weights. Gonna have a side view for y'all in a second. done our workout we just got finished using our dumbbells now we're going to do use the cable machine do some lat door downs and um, that's pretty much it and maybe end with some pull-ups and yeah showing off our muscles a little bit going to take our shirt off because it's daddy time it's like we just want to be able to see our back muscles working when we do our lat pull down so yeah let's get started Started with 25 pounds for this. Ended up being a little light, so eventually had to move up to 40 pounds. And I thought we were gonna be doing these, but the trainer at Planet Fitness had to scoop up some ghosts. He's ghost busting over there, so in a second, we're gonna see him get up and move so he can finish getting all the ghosts out of there, because I did not want to be working out with any ghosts. So yeah. Let's give them a second to try to speed on through this. All right, now we're switching it to the 40 pounds and we're gonna do 10 reps. 10 reps to the front, make sure your shoulders are retracted back. You sit back a little bit, pull down to your chest. And then you'll see in a second that we're gonna do 10 behind our head too. Front of, in front of our head and one set behind our head at 40 pounds. Now we're going to do one more set for each and then we're going to move on to our next workout. You can definitely see them lat muscles working. I love seeing that. That's why I took my shirt off. Oh, yeah, boy. Like 
that sleep down from all our butt sweat. And then we're gonna go take a sip of our Lit Beyond Raw Blue Raspberry pre-workout. Oh yeah, delicioso. Alrighty, we're gonna move on to our next workout. Peace out, Girl Scout. All right, now we're about to do our cable raise. This is our second to last workout for the day. Checking out our booty. Oh, it's a little flat. We gotta work on the booty a little bit, but it's okay. Let's worry about the back right now. So we're gonna do two sets of 10 reps. I think this is at 25 pounds. Want to get a back view for you to see when that's working. I like this workout. Love it. I'm gonna do another side view again, of course. So you obviously see what it looks like from the side. Of course, for this workout, you want to lean back, retract your shoulders back, and pull in. Using your back muscles. Workout for the day. I'm going to finish off with some pull-ups right here. Kind of wanted to start with them just because I want to focus on doing my pull-ups more, but I forgot and went right into dumbbells. So whatever, I guess we're doing it last time. Taking a sip of our pre-workout and checking ourselves out after this nice old workout. Looking good, looking good. So this is our last workout for the day. Woohoo! So we're just gonna hang here for a little bit because apparently it's good for the back and it's fun anyway. So we're doing a little stretching, getting ready, do at least one pull up just to prepare ourselves to be able to not use the whatever that thing is, the seat, because we're about to use it. One day we'll be able to do it without it. But we're gonna put I weigh about 140, so we're going to do 40, which means I'll be lifting 100. Instead of lifting all my weight, I'll lift part of my weight. Then we're going to use them outside bars, so we focus on, focus on the back and not the biceps. I don't know what they'd be called, but I think I only did five of these. Yeah, I did two sets of five reps because these were a little difficult. Like I said, I wanted to do these in the begin beginning of the workout, but I didn't. So we'll do that next time. This is the end of the workout. Kind of tired. A little struggling a little bit. Do a couple dips. I'm working triceps a little bit more when I'm not. Today I only did two sets of pull-ups because I feel like I'm gonna pass out. So now we're just gonna get finished off with some stretching because stretching is essential. Even when you're not working out. So yeah. Okay y'all, so we're back from the gym. We're about to make a protein shake. Now I'm show y'all what I'm using. So I'm about to make a smoothie with the ninja smoothie maker. 
So this is what I like to use. The ISO Pure 100 Hydrolyzed Protein Powder. I got this at GNC as well. It's probably like $40. Um, it's chocolate because chocolate's delish. And yeah. Now if you want, of course, you could always make your own smoothie and you could put water in it and just shake it up in your little sugar bottle. But I'm gonna make a whole smoothie, so yeah. You guys, we just used it for pre-workout. You gotta feel your body after your workout. Make sure you get the nutrients it needs to build your muscle and not just work out from the reading. You know what I mean? So, yeah. So, anyways, what? Actually, I didn't even need to do that because I put it in that cup. So, we're gonna use this. Put some ice on it. Let's make my smoothie. What's up, Tracy, baby? Now I like to use almond milk with a dash of honey because honey is good for you. So, yeah. So, I just like to add some ice. A little bit of milk. Oh no, it's delicious. So good. I'm gonna add a scoop of our chocolate protein. White chocolate. And of course, you could always add fruit if you want. I might add a banana, but I'm about to eat some. I haven't eaten yet today. It's already 3 o'clock in the afternoon, which is not good. But I did wake up kind of late. I'm not going to put a banana in it today just because I want to taste the chocolate. Sometimes I put a little banana in it. smoothie is whoa finished now this one comes of course you got the cup and then you got this too with this blender i was doing this comes with do that i'll show you in a minute get that off of there don't try this at home these are very sharp and it comes with a nice little lid so you can take it to go. This is a big smoothie. I did not need all that, but it's so good. I'm just going to twist that on there. I might have caught my tongue doing that. Like I guess I don't try those at home. The workouts, try at home or at the gym, but that, don't. We are spilling. We are spilling water. I need a straw for this one. It's an actual smoothie. I never made the smoothie that smoothie before. Delish. Yep. And that was our workout and routine for today. Thank you all for joining me on my first video ever and for joining me with my fitness journey i hope y'all come back and continue to like my videos of course subscribe and um, yeah like and subscribe and if you have any questions and you want to ask me about certain things that i do of course i'll post more videos of different workouts that i do and stuff like that but if you have more questions i'm mostly going to show everything that i do to have this physique but yeah if you have any questions you can leave comments below and let me know what you think and stuff like that deuces